This video is brought to you by Squarespace. Hey guys, it's your girl Tina here. Today I'm back with another Sheen haul. You guys seem to really enjoy my previous episode, so I thought I'd do part two. This time I bought pieces from Sheen X, which is like a program they have where they work with indie designers. So the designers can create the pieces and then Sheen does the manufacturing, the selling and the marketing. And in the end they split the profits. So it's a great way to support upcoming indie designers. So I've purchased a bunch of different different pieces, pretty interesting pieces I must say, and we're going colourful this time. And FYI, I bought this with my own money, so you can expect my honest opinion as always. So let's get into it. The first piece I have here is a set and it's designed by Penelope Ping. So it comes with a crop top and biker shorts. I really like this one because of the abstract print and the set was like super cheap. It was around five bucks. So I couldn't resist. I added it to my cart and here it is today. Let's try it on. All right, guys, this set, this $5 set is actually really comfortable, but provides no support for the belly whatsoever, okay? So if you're expecting like that tight compression sort of biker short set, it's not that. I guess it's like very thin. It's a little bit sheer, but I think it looks really cute, you know? You wouldn't work out in this. It's probably more like loungewear, or if you want to just like prop up like a, a jacket over, you probably wear it out. I actually like it. The top is a little bit small in like, it's just, it's very cropped, right? It is a crop top. Duh. Don't mind my bra strap, guys. I'm wearing the wrong bra for this. The buttons is see-through. I'm wearing nude underwear, so it's fine. Not bad for $5, right? I feel like I need to invent new poses. If I was selling clothes, these are the poses. This looks a little bit complicated. It's one of those like cutout dresses and I think it's more like for beach wear, summer wear. And this is by a designer, Ji Yeon Lee. Actually, she has like really interesting pieces on Sheen and it's just really unique. I really like the colors. It's like frills, it has a bit of lace and it has like interesting cutouts. I've never seen anything like this. It's very unique, so I had to try it out. I'm ready. What do we think, guys? It's like a maxi dress for me. It like touches my ankle. It is like actually sheer from the lace downwards. So you can actually see my underwear. And that's why I said like, I'm pretty sure this is for like beach wear. I don't know, would you guys wear this like to other occasions if it wasn't just like holiday or like the beach so in the photo she's got the these like dangling look i think it's like an interesting dress like the one shoulder the tubey high bust area and then we've got like two cutouts like there's a piece of lace there's tears and there's just a bit of material a bit of like sheer lace and it keeps going downwards i'm not like a hundred percent in love with it but i don't like entirely hate it either like something works about this maybe it's just this area, if it was concealed all the way here, I think I'd like it more. It's just like, maybe it's just my underwear line. It's kind of like putting me off a little bit, but it's actually a very comfortable dress. Yeah. What did I pull my underwear up? Oh, I've got a wedge. I should probably wear like high-waisted underwear. So then it's like, you know, you can't see that cut off line. And then yeah, or I can just wear like shorts under it. That looks better. I can make this work. I can make it work. Next, I have this silky pink top, again by Penelope Ping, and it's got like some rouging at the front. It's cropped, and I just really like the silky pink material, to be honest. I really wanted to try something like this. Holding it up, it kind of looks like it's big, but I got an extra small according to my measurements. This is looking weird, but I just realized in the photo, she's got it like tied at the bottom. This is tied at the top, so that's why it's looking a little bit weird. The long bits are at the bottom. Makes sense, it's so much easier to like close up now. And now I gotta do these buttons. <laughs> Kid you not, it takes like 20 minutes to put this top on. There's all the buttons along the sleeves, but it looks really pretty. What do you guys think? I actually really like it. It looks like really nice and girly. It looks very flirty. The shoulders are a little bit puffy as well. So it's kind of giving me like more shape up here. I like it, I like it. The quality actually feels quite nice as well, like the fabric. And considering this was like about $19 and I think I got like 15 or 20% off. But yeah, I think this is actually a win. I like this one. So Penelope Ping, I think you did a really good job with this design, girl. And yes, I'm rocking my side fly now. I've accepted the diagonal fly style. Touch, touching the collar. Whoa. Did I do it? Whoa. Whoa. No? Oh, I'm doing, I'm doing it wrong. I'm like going outwards. 
Whoa. Totally not appropriate for this top. Though. Before we move on to the next outfit, let me tell you a little bit about today's sponsor, Squarespace. It's an all-in-one platform where you can build your online presence through your own website or online store. I've actually used it to create my own website, Tina Creative Studio, where I can showcase my nail art. Squarespace has lots of beautiful templates to choose from that are compatible with any device. They also offer different features and tools to cater to your website needs. For example, you can easily upload your products and manage inventory using the e-commerce feature. I also really like their scheduling tool as clients are able to book through my website and I can manage my time better. To start creating your website, head to squarespace.com for a free trial. And when you're ready to launch, go to squarespace.com slash Tina Yong for 10% off your first purchase of a website or domain. Remember when I told you guys I like my biker shorts? This is kind of like an interesting kind of version of it. It's not really biker shorts, but it's got the similar fit and shape, but it has extra cutouts and a little belt design. Very interesting. I don't own anything like this. Bermuda shorts. Let's get it, let's get it. I may have misjudged this. In the photo, the model's belly button sits right where the buckle is and that's what I was expecting. How? Like, I need to pull it downwards. But then now, like, my knees. <laughs> my kneecaps are in the hole. Wait. Oh no. I just gotta like reposition it a little bit. Like I put it downwards, but can you tell like now my crotch bit is just a little bit, got a drop crotch. It's not like a nice smooth one. <sighs> my belly button is just, <gasps> what if we pull it up? Yes, 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 yes. Okay. This works, but I've got a camel toi. Okay, Zen, be honest. We've got to weigh up, weigh it up. Okay, camel toe, but no belly button showing. Option one, no camel toe belly button shining or drop crotch and like hidden but my knee okay but my knees i think we're just gonna go with the camel toe i think i'm just gonna go with the camel toe it's not that bad until i close my legs i just gotta stand like this all the time <laughs> okay so now these little straps at the bottom it's literally like little bra straps that you can adjust it's growing on me it's definitely growing on me is it i could probably just wear it with like an oversized top so you don't even see this cut out which is like the main feature but then you get to see the little the little straps here that aside the fit is actually really nice really comfortable it's not digging in anywhere and you can adjust it it's just got like a zip up and i think i did get a size small so i'm usually a UK 8 or Australian 8 or US 4. Another thing is like in the photo it looks like it'd be like a thicker denim material. This is actually quite thin so you can like see like my underwear lines and stuff but on the model it's like smooth sailing for her. The back actually looks nice and smooth. I'm like a yes no with this one. It's kind of like yeah sometimes I look at myself and I'm like yeah that works and then I look at myself in other angles and I'm like Ooh, ooh, what is that? The same designer made this lace up crop top. I really like the print. It kind of reminds me of like some fairy tale or like, I don't know, like it's got flowers, floral print everywhere. I like the blue lace at the front. It's like a piece of art, you know what I mean? But on a top. This is kind of cute. This is from the same designer. So like the colors match. This corset kind of like has this dip, right? It kind of comes down and conceals what I'm actually concerned about. So I think wearing this together as a set, it looks nice. I feel more comfortable like this. And it's very fashionable, right? I love the print to this. I love how it's like a thicker material. It feels very sturdy. But what part is confusing me is like this. What are these for? It's like two bra straps at the end of this. I mean, I guess it's just the decoration. It's kind of cute, kind of cute, and just kind of it's got a lot of things dangling in the middle, but so what? It works. It's kind of giving me Alice in Wonderland vibes. The tea party, the Mad Hatter party. I'm tired. It's just like, I'm tired. Is that, is that enough motion? Ugh, oh, I'm tired. Oh, the wind is blowing me. I look sexy. No, don't touch your head. Don't touch my head? Oh. Cute. It's cute. As a set, it is cute. I like it. A damn shoe. That's weird. You see my toes in the middle. How am I going to show you guys this one? This looks like party decorations. It doesn't even look like a top or a dress. Hello. It's like me looking at my neighbors through my blinds. You know how like those like halter neck 
tops are really in. This is like a dress version plus some cutouts. It looks kind of complicated, but trust me, like I'll, I'll put it on and it'll make sense. No, it's gonna rip. It's gonna rip. <laughs> you just pull his arm. <laughs> They're both like. It's okay, I'm gonna take my bra off after I, I, I like get this in position. Oh wait, this one's yeah. supposed to be behind you. <laughs> <laughs> this is like a freaking trap. Oh shit, it's so tight. Here, here, here. Oh, I'm tired. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Hey, what a crap from that. Didn't I say like it all makes sense when I put it on? It didn't make sense when I put it on. That was a mission. I almost felt like mission impossible. I have it on the correct way now. Tell me, be honest. What do you think of this? It's definitely outside my personal style. I've never tried anything like this. I mean, I've tried a top like this and this one is kind of like, it's secure, but not secure in a way. Like I feel like it's tight enough that it holds the girls, but I do feel like it's just this part here. I feel like it just fly open. You can tie this several different ways. You know, like one of those like dresses? This. Oh, I think I like it like this better. It feels like more secure for me. What can we do with these? I'll tuck it in. And now it's just like one of those mini bandeau dresses. You know what I mean? A dress that you can wear many ways. You can mix it up, mix and match, move around certain bits. Elevated. Okay, I think I can work with these. The colors are nice and vibrant. And depending on how you tie it, it'll give you like a different look. Just getting into this, it's a struggle. Guys, this is a very colorful haul. Just FYI, I got this set by Elisa Arianti. It actually comes with like a skirt, but it's sold separately. So you can buy like the top of the skirt alone, but I bought both because I really like the colors. So the top has some like rouging on the side. So you can actually adjust if you want like it longer or like if you want it cropped. The skirt also has the rouging as well. So again, you can adjust how much thigh you want to show. That's kind of cute, right? That's kind of cute. This would be really nice nice for like a nail art design like a swirly one so this number is giving me kind of like retro vibes because it's very bright it's like this swirly retro-ish pattern but the model's poses she looks very futuristic looks really cool really edgy so these are hard poses these are okay. next level it's the white chick pose I think we got the wrong kind of angles, but you know. Yeah, I think that the boots, really like it. It's like, it's a whole outfit, right? It kind of goes together. Wow, this is like the matrix stuff. That's it, that's the end of my modeling career. I like half feel like a K-pop idol and then also like a superhero, like choo, choo, choo. I also feel like I can go to a rave party and get glow sticks. Then we have a very, very happy top. Look at this, guys. Doesn't this just make you very happy when you see this? It's got like two flowers, strategically placed, I assume. And it's a crop top. I don't know, it just looks very, very vibrant, very retro, very happy. This top is really cute. I just wish it was a little bit longer for me because if I put my hands up, it's gonna show my bra. And it's loose as well. If it was tight, at least, I'd feel like it's a bit more secure. Not that I my hands up a lot. How cute are the flowers? And it's just like, hey you, are you looking at my flowers? Thank you. Even with the skirt, it kind of makes like a nice set because like the red, red. But yeah, just um, kind of really bummed with, with this. It was like the cutest top. It's just like always see my bra because it will ride up. So if you have big busts, probably avoid this sort of crop top because yeah, it's loose. It's not fitted. Isn't that surprising? That's so surprising. Everything else that I bought fit pretty well, but the like crop top tee is too cropped. I wouldn't have guessed that. Oh. My milkshake brings her the boys to the yard. We have come to the end of this try on haul and overall I think I did pretty well with my purchases. I think I found like some more unique pieces, if you know what I mean. Like most of these stuff, it's not like the sort of typical fashion out there, especially with fast fashion. Everything kind of looks the same, but with the Sheen X collections, you can find like pieces that have like unique colors, unique patterns, unique fits. Anyways, that is it from me guys. Subscribe if you haven't already and remember to turn on notifications so you guys don't miss out on any future videos that I post and I shall speak to you guys next time. Bye! It's riding up. <laughs>